Guys, uh, that's not good. I broke my tripod. There's a little plastic piece that fell off. And yeah, you just witnessed me breaking my tripod. My camera wasn't even filming. I had it here, and I was sitting like, I was sitting like this. I got up, ran, it ran into the table, turned my camera on because it hit the volume button, and the tripod leg just snapped. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh. So, what happened is the pin broke out of the hole. So I put the pin back in, but I can't find the other side of the pin. You see that side? I can't find that side of the pin. And then this um, came out and that plastic piece broke off that was holding it in place. So I have to shove it in there and put the pin in halfway and it'll hold it. But uh, yeah, let's get into the Joe story part two. So guys, here we are again, the Joe Book 2, October 2014. This one's not as long as I promise, I promise you that. One sunny day in Bibbyland, Joe was walking on the beach when suddenly... An eel jumps out of the water and licks the air. <gasps> then suddenly an elephant mother, an elephant's mother skydives from a plane and lands on the eel licking the air. <gasps> Happy. And there's a picture of the elephant landing. Then the three of them head to Chuck E. Cheese's to have pizza. See, there's Pac-Man, there's a spinner, tables, arcade, Galaga, eel, elephant, and man, Bibby, sorry. Then as they start to get close, a giant appears over Chuck E. Cheese's and picks up the whole building. And he flips it upside down. Suddenly, a mutant bunny bites him on the leg and he drops Chuck E. Cheese. Sadly crushing our three friends and everyone inside. And he's still on his leg. Rip, Miss, Miss Sam P. Elephant, two, 1979 to 2014. Crushed by Chuck E. Cheese's. Rip, Mr. Joe Bibby. 1987 to 2014, crushed by Chuck E. Cheese. Cheese is cheese, and back to cheese is here. Rip Mr. Jack Eel, 1984 to 2014, crushed by Chuck E. Cheese. As their caretaker is mourning over his own son, Joe Bibby, he spots something in the distance over here. Mayor Frank M. Dwarffoot is being attacked by zombies, so he runs frantically to his house. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Okay, Joe Bibby cheese, cheese, and he keeps the cheese to the third one. Just making sure I didn't change it again. When he approaches his house, he sees dozens of zombies and panics. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, thirty-four. Okay, so you're right with the dozens. He sprints to his door and opens it and runs inside. 28 zombies, so he loses zombies. He slams the door, turns around, and gets mauled by four zombies. Oh, that's sad. Dang it. There he is, zoom out. On the news later that night, back to you, Jeff. Thanks, Mary. Possible zombie outbreak in New York. New York City. Did I mean city? Possibly, okay. Man gets killed by zombies. Everyone is frantic and races on the space shuttle to head to the moon to drop a nuke on Earth. Set to launch November 23rd, 2014. And that concludes the Joe Book 2. Hope you guys enjoyed me breaking my tripod and the Joe Book. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.